Bruce Cassidy has led the Bees to a sixth straight playoff berth. Boston has won their last two games. Five games to go, you can feel that playoff anticipation in the building and around the league. Off we go, Penguins and Bruins. In the last Bruins victory, he is really dominant on the ice. It's impossible not to notice him. Chris Letang down the right wing, tries a shot, and that will go high and off the glass, back out to center. Two goals against on 29 shots Saturday afternoon. Penguins with some trouble, puck bouncing into the blue paint, trying to find it is the Smith, and he's able to cover up for the whistle. Gensel down the wing, curls to the line. Ruido with the shot, it's loose, Swayman kept it out. Clifton will clear for Boston. Crosby bursting in Gensel's got a chance, fires, he scores! What a play! Jake Gensel makes it one nothing Penguins. How many players in the league would be able to score this goal as Gensel throws it in that triangle and then turns it to the forehand, backhand to forehand past Coyle. Boy, that's a beautiful thing to watch right there. And then he goes five hole on Swayman and it's all got to be done in perfect transition. There can't be any hitch in that. A little gamesmanship, if you will, Mirzi, because Brian Rush was out there a long time. Both these teams trying to get the power play going. Gantz with front for Rust. Raquel works that far side. Gensel, Latang opens up. Right at the dot is Crosby. Looks and fires. Fought off by Swim. Comes back to him. Then the spare, but puck is loose. Unable to finish with Gensel's Rust. Jake back to Latang. The momentum, the Penguins have done that. Well, that was incredible there. They certainly have. They shot at every opportunity. Gensel hits the post there. Noshik with the desperation. He's able to just get a piece of it. Mike Riley, pestered by Rodriguez. Players tumble down. There's Kappa going to Boyle. Boyle a chance and denied by Swayman. Get that feeling that we are so close to playoff hockey. You can feel it, right? The only thing you missing can. is the weather. What? Yeah, what happened? Why does it feel like it's still <laughs> November? Uh, give it a couple of days. Marshawn sails that one in the left hand of Casey to Smith. And he's really been on an explosion, especially on the road. He's scoring a ton of goals on the road right now. I mean, he's got 11 since February 19th. Look out of March on the drive, stopped by DeSmith. They're getting on pucks, turning them over, and boy, Casey Smith's got to be sharp. That one there. Peeling back is Marino, trying the other side of the ice. Ah! Jason Zucker, Dude! leaving it for Marcus Pedersen. Marino fires it forward. Here comes Jason Zucker in on goal. He scores! Zucker! He rattles the cage to make it 2 0 Penguins. Take a look at this breakout play as it goes through the center. I don't know if Carter touched that or not, but he knew that on his backside. What a play that was. Letting it go right through to Zucker, who elevates the puck over the glove hand of Swayman. Swayman's got the glove up, but when he shoots it, he puts the glove down. Now Patrice Bergeron, the future Hall of Famer. Bergeron has a backhand key. Comes to Marshawn, looks and fires loose in front at the brusque with an eye by DeSmith. Get in front of it. Let's take a look at this bouncing puck. It's going to come right to Marshawn, and it comes off Casey's shoulder. And he makes another save, so a real good job there. That one high, there's the rebound, and DeBrus shoots it right back into Casey, who's got that glove. Boston having won their last two overall. Loose puck right in the middle of the zone. The tag finds the puck, goes all the way over, and score! Jake gets all again! 3-0 Pittsburgh. Flips the puck up in the air to buy some time. He goes off the ice. The Bruins can't play the bouncing puck. Carlo chops it up. Latang stays on it and finds Gensel way over to the left of Swayman. Nice little curl and drag. Gensel's way over here at the edge of your screen. 18 points combined over the last five games. And big minutes too, Bob. They're both up over 20 minutes on average now. This will probably be the 11th straight game for Jake Gensel over 20 minutes. Playing a lot of hockey, and they are producing. The tang with a birthday coming up on Sunday. Slowing down, just not in his vernacular. 
Marshawn to the front, the press with the tip puck is loose, and it's stamped away from McAvoy. Great feed by Marshawn, looking for a stick, and Casey Smith shutting the door. Look at Marshawn, he looks for the stick there, DeBrusk out in front, Casey makes that. Now Curtis Lazar, with a little bit of space, passes in behind the goal, but back in front for Lazar, and again the Penguins. Lazar trying to go back door. Coyle pounces on it for Boston. Charlie Coyle, low to high, Forbert with a shot, change direction, couple of times, juggled by DeSmith, it's loose, lunging is DeSmith, can he cover up, bodies just outside the crease, it squirts free, and now it's Forbert. Forbert over to Clifton, Clifton, redirection goes wide to DeSmith. No stick to Smith. Goaltender Casey DeSmith, who's getting bumped and banged. Sacha, Glenn Hall. Well, look at that pass. Runs. Here comes Jake Gensel, takes it off the wall, cutting toward the net, stopped by Swayman. What a pass. Was that Crosby in behind the defense when he was stepping up on the play? Tremendous pass. And we got a penalty here. Other than that, he might be the smartest player that I've ever seen play the game. And he's playing with another. Uh... Carries with speed through center. It's redirected in by Grizzly. Paula over to Coyle. Coyle with a centering pass into Smith sliding. Denies Smith. Hold by Riley. Doubled across for Grizzly. Pretty good rocket of a shot there by Raquel. Wayman didn't even react. He didn't even move. Well, not no sick trying to sneak in. Backhander stuff. Rebound Felino. He's knocked down. Felino is going to have an open net. And there's Raquel with the good body check on Felino. For goals in four consecutive games. In the circle, Crosby. There is Heinen on and off his stick. Heinen pokes no. it back. Matheson shot off the post. Was that four posts tonight? Coach of the Boston Bruins, Bruce Cassidy. Here's this opportunity. Raquel looks like he got a piece of that. Turn, certainly changed the direction of that puck that was heading one direction. Went across the body of Swayman, hit the post on the other side. So. Was looking for points 98 and 99 on the season. Jake DeBrus flying in down the middle. DeBrus with a shot, missed well wide. Oh, here comes Gensel. Gensel. Got it for the empty net. He scores! Hat trick, and it's 40s night for Jake Getzel. And this one here. The only thing he had to do was miss the referee. Yeah, I noticed that. Did you see that? What a strong performance. And a 52 save shutout for Casey DeSmith.